fashion sewers and welcome to Fashion Sewing Blog TV. I'm Colleen G. Lee and in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to do an easy double welt pocket. Here I have an example of a double welt pocket also known as a jet or bound pocket and what it is is a pocket that has a bag on the inside to the wrong side of the garment and then you have these two little I say slashes of fabric that gives it this sleek neat elegant look this is the wrong side of the pocket here we have the welt section which is interfaced and that will be your fashion fabric and beyond that point is going to be a lining and this will make up your pocket bag first thing you need to do is mark out two parallel lines which are these blue lines here and the starting point has to be, this is very important, at the same exact point. I'll explain that a little bit deep in detail later. Now the middle line here, this slash line is what it's referred to, is where we're actually going to cut. So we won't worry about that at the moment. So the next stage, once you've got your pocket marked out, is to take it to your garment. On the right side of your garment, place the right side of your pocket matching up your markings to the, your drawn welt and place some pins into position. You won't need many, just a, a couple at the top. I'm now going to take it to my sewing machine. Now when you're sewing your parallel lines these two here, make sure that you're starting and stopping at the same exact point. That's going to be very important for the shape of your pocket. Needle down. Tap, tap. And pull my pins out as I go. I've now sewn my two parallel lines and they're starting at the exact same point. I'll just show you the wrong side. So remember that's going to be stabilised because that's where your pocket's going to be. That's a garment. And the next step is to slash into this broken line. I'll just turn my work this way. I'll pinch my work. Just put a little snip into that. Then open it out and insert my scissors. Now I'm going to stop roughly about one centimeter from the parallel lines and then I'm going to position my scissors to cut diagonally to the stitch line. And then do the same to the other parallel line to create a little triangular shape and I'm going to do the same to the other side. I slashed into the pocket area and I have my two triangles at each end and now going to pull the pocket bag through to the wrong side of the garment and also the top of the spacing here. Now that can be quite tricky, let's pull it through like so. So I'm now working on the wrong side. And then the next thing to do is to press this nice and flat, this area. Now that I've pressed the pocket on the wrong side, the next thing to do is to form your welts. So I've got some notches at the sides here. I'm going to get the welt and position it like so. And then once I'm happy with the shape, it will be a case of pressing that into position. And repeat the process to the other welt, bringing that up to meet the first welt and then press. I've now finished pressing the welts. I'll just turn it on to the right side so you can see. Now I need to keep these layers together and the next stitch I'm going to be doing is a stitch in a ditch. So I'm going to be following the seam line and sewing all the way around the pocket. 
next stitch I'm going to do is stitching in the ditch so I'm going to make sure that my needle is as close to the seam line as possible put my needle down in my work and put down I'm going to go all the way around I have now stitched in the ditch or sink stitched along the seam line of the pocket to hold those layers together and we're now going to sew the pocket bag so I'm turning my work to the wrong side bringing the bag to meet the top of the well position that in place and then pin and once I've done that I'll take it to my sewing machine and sew that into place with my work right side up facing me I'm going to pull back my work so that I'm working on the wrong side I'm now going to sew along the top of the pocket and then once I've done that I'll sew along the seams of the pocket and here you have your two welts that are held in place by stitching into the ditch or sink stitching and the pocket bag is on the inside I'll just show you what that looks like on the wrong side so that's a great fashion sewing technique for creating easy double welt pockets so why not give it a try don't forget to subscribe to Fashion Sewing Blog TV for free weekly video tutorials and if you have any comments or queries please put me in the comment box below and I'll see you next time.